everybody. Happy July already. Can you believe it? And seven days in. Hope you all had a wonderful holiday weekend. This is the Youth Services Book Chat at the Amherst Public Library. We have some really fun books to look at today. First, I want to talk about nonfiction books. This is a biography about Maurice Senda. Oh my gosh, what a scary looking book that is. But I love biographies. You learn so much. So in the table of contents, it'll tell you everything you need to know. But you also have these really cool AV2 codes. So stop into the library, see the interactive books that we have, and check out our juvenile biography section. And while you're over that way, there's nonfiction books on earthquakes, how earthquakes shape the earth. This is a Shaping Our Earth book. It also has the AV2 signal. So that means come on in and get interactive with how earthquakes are formed. It's amazing. Great pictures too. And who knows, maybe on your summer vacation, you might come across a volcano or something that relates to the earthquake. And then we have some picture books. How about a night walk? Who doesn't love being able to stay up late during summer vacation and going on a night walk? This is by Marie Dorleans. Oh, I hope you are going to like this one. Mama opened our bedroom door, interrupting the nighttime darkness. Wake up, you two, she whispered. Let's go so we can get there on time. Where do you think she's going? We got dressed without talking, our eyes half closed. It was the middle of the night. Outside, crickets chirped in the corners of the garden. The summer air smelled of irises and honeysuckle. Oh, I bet you can close your eyes and picture it. Come and check out The Night Walk by Marie Dorian. Oh, and then we have The Bench. Has anyone heard about Megan, the Duchess of Sussex, writing a book? Well, this is it. It's called The Bench and it's brand new. Its pictures are by Christian Robinson, who happens to be a cow to cow winning and bestseller and illustrator. Can you tell by all the really neat benches? This is a beautiful book about the relationship of a father and his son. This is your bench where life will begin for you and our son, our baby, our kin. This is your bench where you'll witness great joy. From here you will rest, see the growth of our boy. He'll learn to ride a bike as you watch with pride. He'll run and he'll fall and he'll take it in stride. What a great story. Come see what else happens from the bench. The bench, Megan, the Duchess of Sussex. And if you wanna talk cute, let's talk about kittens. Home is Where the Heart Is by Emma Dodd. Who doesn't like a kitten in all this pink? What is it that makes our house a special place to be? Let's think about this place called home, and maybe we will see another book that rhymes just like the bench. Home is where I can be and where you can be you. Home spending time together, just us two. When we go adventuring further, far or near, home is where we come back to. Home is always here. Homes where we find all the things that we love the best. Home is where we play. Can you guess what rhymes with best that we're gonna say? Home is where we rest. Cats love to rest. Come see what else they do. Home is where the heart is by Emma Dodd. And a Peppa Pig new book. How exciting is this? Peppa loves yoga. And we love Peppa Pig. It's been a very busy morning at Playgroup. Peppa and her friends have played instruments, dressed up in fancy clothes, 
and made the messiest of crafts. Speaking of crafts, we're going to tell you about that at the end of this little preview. Now we're going to say hello to a visitor. Madame Gazelle says, Oh, gasped the children. They wonder who the visitor is. Bring, bring! The visitor is at the door. The children can't wait. They start to cheer. I'm not going to tell you who it is. You have to come check out the book. It's Papa Loves Yoga. Come and get this brand new book. And since they were doing crafts, I have to remind you that tonight is another craft day. We've got two o'clock to six o'clock and we're making hot air balloons. So come on down. Rain or shine, we are going to be here. If it's raining, we'll be inside, but let's hope not. It's a beautiful day. Thank you so much for listening. Bye now.